Thanks for checking out this video about SharePoint Implemented's internet template. Let's check it out. So I'm the SharePoint admin in this company and it's 9 a.m. right now. I just got to work and I really love showing everyone how I spend the first two minutes of every morning. The internet homepage, which is the screen I'm on now, is the dashboard for the whole company. There's some very cool stuff happening this month. Like, see here, a few employee anniversaries and birthdays are coming up. A couple of interesting company events are approaching and this is cool. I just noticed that a third flagged location is appearing on the map. That means a new store just opened up. Awesome. And here's a great employee morale booster. Michelle has been spotlighted for her great work. I'm going to check out this announcement about quarterly profits during lunch. Speaking of lunch, I think I'll go out today since the weather forecast is pleasant. That reminds me I need to click this link on the quick lunch panel to get info on the upcoming Easter holiday schedule. You know what? With so much stuff going on, I really feel like I've gotten a good pulse of the company now. Well, that's it for the fun stuff. Now time to move on to my tasks for the day. Now, here is what my manager emailed me to do today. New employee, global top navbar entry, sales department event should be company-wide, and new rotating banner. No problem. All right, I'm going to zoom through this super fast now, okay? For the new employee, I execute a search. Here's the result that I need. I grab the relevant data. I'll fill that data into this user information list. This will get picked up by the employee search web part, anniversaries web part, and birthdays web part. To create the finance department link on the global top nav bar, all I have to do is create a new item in this list. It'll be automatically reflected in all sites, site collections, and web apps. Okay, for this sales department calendar event to get aggregated into the main calendar, all I have to do is check this post to main checkbox. The exact same procedure applies to announcements. Adding a new banner is easy. I'll indicate the image path, hit save, and it should start rotating the existing one automatically. I can change the rotation speed, but I'll keep the default of three seconds for now. And here we are, back on the homepage. I can see my changes at a glance. And check it out, the banner is rotating. By the way, don't you love the branding on the page? Adding colors and a logo is surprisingly difficult in default SharePoint, but easy in this product. And I guess that's the whole point. With the right building blocks, getting things done fast becomes the norm. You know, my mom tells me that I've liked building blocks since I was a kid. Maybe that's why I smile every time I use SharePoint now. Thanks for tuning in. Check out SharePointImplemented.com for more details. Goodbye.